rocket, putting the man in uh, space, putting a spacecraft around uh, Venus and landing a craft in uh, Mars. Work on all these activities are going on for few years. And uh, this success today will inspire us and will spur us to take those efforts even more strongly so that we will make our country proud again and again and again. Thank you very much for every one of you who have directly or indirectly participated in this mission, encouraged us, intentionally or unintentionally helped us in, in all, 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 for every one, of, every one of you. A big thank you because even, even a, a casual remark, an unintended point can, can help a person who is uh, striving to reach a goal. It, the person who is making that remark may not have meant it that way, but sometimes it can ignite a... a that's why I, I said that even unintended help is, uh, is very, very, very uh, welcome, and we are very, very thankful for that. Thank you, Team ISRO, for uh, supporting all of us. The amount of affection I, we received when this mission came into this final stage, the number of people who gave us confidence that nothing can go wrong and uh, this is going to be successful. The amount, the, in fact, I was not that much confident because uh, we have seen a couple of times uh, issues because I, I know very well as a, as a person who has been doing in this, uh, in this domain for 36 years, I know there are thousands of things, any of that could uh, can any time go wrong and derail, but so many of the people because that I only see as the reflection of the effort we have put, that people are so, so, so happy to see this effort and they want us to succeed. It is not that uh, we are, they know that we are going to succeed, the people want us to succeed. So thank you very much for uh, everyone, for your love and affection. We will continue to do our best and make our flag fly, ISRO's as well as India's flag fly high. Thank you very much. Honorable, Honorable Prime Minister called me and conveyed his greetings to each one of you, you and your family for the wonderful work you did in ISRO. Uh, so thank, uh, thanks are to him for the support that he is giving to us for missions like Chandrayaan 3 and the missions that are in the offing. I think that's a great word of you know, comfort that we are receiving for pursuing the inspirational work that we are doing for the nation. I want to tell you and I want to thank you also for each and everyone who prayed with us in the last many days, uh, who wanted this uh, success to happen in ISRO. I thank all those people in all around the country and maybe be beyond the country for their blessings and wishes and, and affection that he has given to each one of us for doing this work for the last so many years. I want to specifically thank uh, some senior people who have been standing with us, especially the name of Kiran Kumasa. <clears throat> and Mr. Kamalakar, Sri Koteshwar Rao. They have been helping so much. They were part of the team to help them to get the confidence and get the reviews done to ensure that nothing goes uh, with any mistakes. And of course, this is not the work of us alone. This is a work of a generation of ISRO leadership and ISRO scientists. And this is a journey we started in Chandrayaan 1, continued in Chandrayaan 2, and Chandrayaan 2 craft is still working and doing a lot of communication work with us. And all the team that contributed to building Chandrayaan 1 and Chandrayaan 2 should be remembered and thanked while we celebrate Chandrayaan 3. And this is an incremental progress and definitely a great, huge one it is. And thank you so much for all the support and work that you have done. Thank you.